Hey folks, Lou Jones again. Welcome back to another trailer reaction video. This time for Guardians of the Galaxy Volume Three, the new trailer. Again, this was uh, Super Bowl last weekend. Uh, I forgot to mention for the trailer for the Flash in that video. I forgot to mention the Danny Elfman score in there for Batman was was awesome to listen to. So, but of course, this is Guardians of the Galaxy Volume Three. This is, of course, the sequel to the first movie and the second movie. And of course, the third Guardians movie, as you can presume, it is the 32nd film in the MCU. It's also directed by James Gunn and written by him. And you have the assembled cast, of course: Chris Pratt, Zuzu, Zoe Zalanda, Dave Bautista, Karen Gillian, Paul Mulvaney, Vin Diesel, Bradley Cooper, Sean Gunn, and Sylvester Stallone's in there too. I don't know if I will, but and this is part of Phase Five of Marvel as well. Oh, but this film, this film in Atlanta. Okay, well, Georgia. Well, I live in Georgia, so, but not Atlanta. <laughs> uh, the Guardians of the Gal the premise of the movie, though, is that the Guardians of the Galaxy are just sent to life from nowhere, but when parts of Arda's past surfaces, resurfaces, Peter Paul must leave the Guardians on a dangerous mission to return them that could lead them to the team dissolving. And the film is set to be released May 5th, on May 5th of this year, 2023. Really good poster too. Mm. Uh, for this thumbnail for this video will probably be the poster of the movie because I can get the background of the trailer, so I just didn't like the thumbnail for it. It looked pretty messy. But like I will be watching it with my headphones on because I don't want to have any copyright claims or copyright issues or any copyright strikes from YouTube, so but I have this trailer right now on YouTube. So you'll be able to hear my thoughts on it while I'm watching the trailer. Afterwards, but you'll be able to see my reaction to it. Yeah. Oh, and I did get my thoughts a couple of months ago on the first trailer for Guardians. Yeah. Yeah. Here we go. Hey guys. Alright. Here we go. Go ahead, guys. You show. All right. Push and play now.
again. That trailer was awesome. I enjoyed it. Really, you know, there's an updated version of that song, Since You've Been Gone, you know, Since You've Been Gone, you know, something like that. But the trailer looks awesome. I like the way group, not group, um, group, yeah, of course. Group, you know, looks more muscular and stuff. Looks like buff, or even working out at the gym. But anyway, the trailer looks awesome. Uh, looks like they're facing a villain who, you know, is up to no good. And, you know, the visuals look, like, fantastic. And it looks like it'll be some sad moments. It looks like it'll be a bit dark for Guardians film, but it does retain the sense of humor. You know. Again, I think after, you know, like Thor Love and Thunder, when that was a comedy every five seconds, I guess people got tired of that. So maybe Marvel was trying to go a little darker with the movies. Like I said, with Ant Man, from heard it as a bit darker movie. Maybe they're trying to do that with Guardians too. But still have to change the sense of humor. And you can still have a sense of good sense of humor in a movie. You know, there's nothing wrong with having humor in a comic book film. But sometimes you can go a little dark with it too. You know. But this was entertaining. I like this trailer a lot. I uh, that has to do with Groot. I mean, with Rocket and his past, which we don't know much about his past, but this movie will review that. And you're seeing that cute dog and, you know, the cute little... What was it? Otter? Yeah. Yeah. CGI, of course, but this looks interesting for sure. And I like to see how Gamora and uh, Peter are going to rebuild the relationship. Though, even though I see it, this part because the original Gamora, she passed. Well, not the original, but... You know, the one from the future, and the future one from the past, so, you know, doesn't know him very well. <laughs> Even pushes him on my... But maybe I can see them fall in love again, just slowly in time. Unless this is the last Guardians movie, I kind of doubt it, you know. Because I can see them making another Guardians movie, probably. Depending on how well this one's done, I don't think they're done completely well, but this is another part of the movie, part for Phase 5. But, you know, this trailer was awesome. It would like we have sad moments in it, you know. Of the Guardians, you know since they've been criminals themselves, but they came together and been together, say, the universe several times, you know, you know, one from uh, the first one in the movie, which I forget his name, Ronan, and then defeating Quill's father, you know, Kurt Russell, and then helping the Avengers, you know, bring everybody back from Thanos' snap. So they've done a lot. They've been through a lot, you know, and I like that, you know, Karen Gillian's part of the team, you know, Nebula. Yeah, it just looks like it'd be a lot of fun. And the comedy so there from the other show, there's still comedy in this film. But this, you know, didn't show a lot of comedy toward the end, you know, when <laughs> when Charlie looks at, you know, Nebula and she's like, Stop it He's like, We get beautiful from whether you push my father will he picked a beautiful choice. <laughs> but now I guess that maybe he's just mad at some other but it still looks like it'd be fun, you know, and yet serious sometimes. But I definitely can't wait to see Cars Against Part 3. Again, the film is set to be released May 5th of this year. So this trailer really impressed me. This trailer was awesome. So tell me, guys, in the comments down below, what do you think of Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3, the new trailer? For the, what do you think of the new trailer? And what did you think of it? And do you look forward to this movie? And uh, what do you think of the previous two Guardian Galaxy movies? What do you think of them in your opinion? So let me know in the comments down below, guys, what you think of the, this trailer, if you've seen it. And you do look forward to it. And uh, stay tuned for next. I think I'll be talking about Transformers. The intro for that, Rise of the Beast. Transformers 7. So stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching, guys. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you later. Stay tuned for the next trailer at reaction video. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.